Hi, good afternoon. I'm making this recording on the day where the O-level results of 2021 has been issued out. Right. So, um, I do not know about any particular trend and I'm, I'm not going to talk about any trend like which school is doing the best. No, this recording is not about that. This recording is especially for students who have completed their O levels right, of 2021 and they are deciding to go towards A levels and they are thinking of maybe doing a subject they have never done before as to the run-up to O levels and one subject that I like to talk about very close to my heart because I teach this subject and I have taught this subject for many years across two different syllabus right it's called management of business now why is the, does this subject sound so new well if you're based in Singapore all right um, it's not offered in junior college it's only offered in millennia institute together with principles of accounting this subject principles of accounting obviously is it's very familiar to students um, at O level some students do a POA we always call it POA right but in the old days before they took out this subject there was another subject called business studies BS so POA O levels is linked to POA obviously A levels and business studies of O levels is linked to management of business so management of business is the continuation of business studies but in other exam boards in UK um, it's not called management of business it's called business studies right for most um, exam boards especially especially the, the British many students know it as business studies so this subject I'm going to talk about now um, is not new and especially when you, you are continuing to get your your degree your bachelor's degree and up to master's there could be a situation where because we are talking about a blended kind of uh, uh, education you may pop by and see it again together with economics so measuring of business um, for the Singapore exams is um, you can sit for it in private school Millennium Institute or as a private candidate I have a program where you don't need to have any experience in POA and I can guide you and we can complete the entire syllabus in one year we don't need two years or three years one year all right and um, I, I'm going to embark on that procedure maybe once the results come out like today all level results come out I'll be taking one or two students who may want to to sit for a levels for this subject called management of business 2022 all right so let me just tell you a bit about this subject there are two papers first paper is basically straight out from a textbook there is a textbook and um, the topics are not that tough it's, um, it's about motivation the role of HRM and, and all. some of my students already know part of it because they tell me that um, because of Elon Musk they, 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 they like to learn what Elon Musk does and how, how he, he engages the stakeholders think so a lot of them already know a bit about it all right so as paper one paper two is tough where they give you a three page kind of a case study and you're supposed to analyze it all right um, I teach economics too at A levels and general paper I, I feel that the difficulty of management of business is almost the same level as economics so um, if you study the proper way for MOB, you study case studies from the beginning and not straight up from just textbook memorizing, you'll be fine. I have students who got distinction uh, just by studying MOB for one year. I have. So um, not everybody can teach MOB. I, I believe some people feel that MOB is easy to teach. It's not that easy. But if you're interested, you can contact me, call in ongts at hotmail.com and I'll give you a free trial lesson. All right, and then you can decide for yourself, are you suitable? All the best in your educational journey.